Good morning. On behalf of Governor Cuomo and uh, Pat Foy, my executive director, I'd like to welcome everyone here to Stewart International Airport. It's a great morning to celebrate this great event uh, commemorating the uh, America's entry into World War I, supporting the French. This is a celebration, and not only a commemoration, of celebrating two of the world's great democracies, France and the United States of America. This event couldn't be taking place today without the support of Orange County. Steve Newhouse, Orange County Executive, is really a great supporter of the airport who helped us close the deal with Norwegian Airlines and, and bringing the air show here. And on that note, enjoy the morning. This is a great historic moment. Be safe and enjoy the day. Thank you very much. Hey, good morning, everybody. I'm Colonel Christophe Dorea from the French Air Force, and I am the officer commanding the French Air Force detachment for this U.S. tour in 2017. So welcome, everybody. Uh, we are really happy to be here today. I'm particularly be happy to be here in the United States because a long, long time ago, I was an exchange cadet at the U.S. Air Force Academy. So I'm really happy to be here. I'm more of a happy to be near New York City because last year I was still the military advisor of the French ambassador to the UN in New York City so I'm just back eight months after it's a great pleasure for me and a great honor. So I'm here with a complete team of 72 persons, 11 aircraft, 10 Alpha jets, you will see eight of them flying in a few minutes and we have as a support aircraft the Airbus A400 Wilhelm that just took off. The Airbus A400M is a brand new transportation aircraft in the French Air Force. We just got this aircraft three years ago. And I'm going to give you some facts about this aircraft. It's 45 meters long, it's a span of 42 meters. It can uh, it weighs 15 tons, and uh, you can carry more than 25 tons of freight, uh, freight we are carrying this morning for this tour. We can carry also and drop to around 120 parachutists and uh, or two or three uh, uh, what we call EPCs. Okay, it's a long-range aircraft. It's roughly the equivalent of the C-17. However, it's fitted with propellers, which allows it to be used on uh, grass or sand runways, and not hard runways. This is particularly interesting for our operations in Africa in Sahel and in the Mali. So the aircraft is coming back. I will let you enjoy the flight and see this aircraft, which is displayed only for the fourth time in the, in the US. So enjoy the flight. So the A400M is uh, an aircraft built by uh, the Airbus Group, a uh, European company, and uh, it's a, uh, let's say, uh, it's a kind of technology and new air transportation capacities. If you go into the cockpit, the avionics is brand new, and uh, the type of avionics is the one you find in the Airbus A380 uh, uh, or the Boeing 787. So this is brand new technologies. The aircraft is, of course, a combat aircraft, so it's also fitted with some other systems to, to the theater of operations. And uh, it's stationed in France on, at Orléans Air Base. It's uh, about, uh, let's say, 80 miles southwest from Paris.
On the left, the aircraft is coming back with the gear down and the uh, landing lights on. So the aircraft just landed. You have uh, been able to appreciate this uh, small runway landing capacity. It can land on a 3,000 feet runway and it can take off, of course, on a 3,000 feet turn. The captain of this service today is Captain Pelopidas. He is in the French Air Force, the reference officer, the reference pilot for the operational use of this aircraft in the French Air Force. He's been flying uh, more than 10,000 flight hours and uh, he's been flying on over every theater of operations in Middle East, in Africa, in Afghanistan, and uh, he's a very qualified pilot. So, big applause for him, please.